right, we can leave these guys alone, and then the other part of the quest was return to Preston. I'm going to take a quick peek and see if that texture glitch has resolved itself over here. As much as I hate to go back into that damn water. And if it hasn't, we're just going to go check out Preston and see what he has to say about us. Finishing our first task for the Minutemen. Huzzah. Hello, Red Stag Doe. One shot, one kill. Love this rifle. Seems really odd that there's this big billboard here and there's nothing going on with it. But whatever. Might be something important later on. That nice being go. on the move again. Fewer paper cuts than back home. I bet. Glad we already cleared that crossing. All right. Yeah, I'm glad we went with the quick reload mag on the sniper rifle rather than going with the extended mag. It's nice not to have to take a huge amount of time to reload this thing. Nope, texture bugs are still there. Alright, we'll come back another time. So we'll just fast travel back to Sanctuary and go talk with... Preston. Start a fight you can't finish, try putting away your weapon, there's a slight chance your opponent might just might forgive you. I doubt that. Strongly. Very strongly. <laughs> Hey, maybe our trader guy actually is doing something. I gave up alcohol after settling down here. Doctor said I shot my liver. What have you got to trade today? Yes! Alright, so it looks like he just sells. Wow, that is really good price. Or maybe not. No, he's the same price everywhere else. Damn it. Oh, burnt. Wow, you really have a whole bunch of crap. Five adhesive, though, that's kind of worth it there. <gasps> Toy trucks and Nuka Cola trucks. Okay, I'm buying the teddy bear. Yeah, there's a lot of trucks. They're not nearly as rare as they used to be, so I think I'm going to focus on collecting the uh, teddy bears. Well, good. I'm glad I spent so much money on a guy who carries a whole bunch of junk. Oh, wait, wait, he has caps. I can sell crap to him. Like, 39 road leathers. 238. Oh, that saved my weight. All right, let's see. We don't want moonshine. We don't want the bourbon. Get rid of the buff out. Get rid of the cram. Canned dog food. Uh, get rid of the Gwinnett stout. Radiated blood. Interesting. Um, you probably can't afford getting rid of all of those. Um, noodle cup. Uh, we might use that. Psychos. Alright, can you sell maybe one? And maybe sugar bomb, sugar bomb. And... A line. All right. Well, now we have another source. New Coca Cola is the only thing I can drink that wakes me up. Otherwise, it's all hazy. But I kind of actually want now that I have this. Like that's a decent selection. Hmm. I wonder if it's worth. Oh, hey. There's trash can Carla. Hey, Carla. You again. Why are you the you only betray? trader that comes to my town? And why did I build a stand Let's that only sells the same yeah, yeah, stuff you have? Okay. First, let's start by selling her a whole bunch of crap. She can buy the jet. 
and we'll buy at least a teddy bear from her. Um, we already had a hunting rifle. Come on, give me something that uses an ammo type that I have a bunch of that I don't use. Ah. Hmm. Batting helmet. Pompadour wig. Actually, that's yeah, charisma. Nice. Uh, fertilizer, biometric scanners, duct tape. Ugh, everything's so expensive. <gasps> she doesn't have any teddy bears in stock. That's so mean. Um, well, I guess I'll accept a... God, duct tape is expensive. No, I don't need bobby pins. Yep, fine, I'll take a toy car, I guess. You're lame, Carla. We need someone better. I'm kind of tempted to make a we get a weapons trader to see if we have any better stock in. I don't know if it varies, though. Mm, it's going to be six levels before I get the better perk. You know what? Screw it. I'm building it. You're tied to this place, kid. Your energy. Um... Armor weapons. Thousand caps. Eh, it's not like I'm using them for anything anyway. Produces income based on the total population. Oh, I actually make money. Excellent. I did not actually realize I was getting a benefit out of these guys. All right, you, sir. You've just got a different store to handle. I'm looking for weapons. Ha 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 ha! Alright, compensated bolt action pistol. That's, that's using 308 rounds. I've got, I think 308s are. Yeah, that's what my sniper rifle uses. That's better than that. Um, really? Really? This is, this is all you've got? Aw, oh, you're useless. Need any of this. Also, he... Oh, I guess he keeps everything that I uh, sold. <gasps> he has more... Oh, he's got another resource amount. All right, let's sell him the rest of our drugs. Uh, put the sugar bombs. You can take all the vodka, all the whiskey. You can take... Uh, what else do I not need? I think that'll be it. Uh, no, don't cancel the trade. Take the trade. Thank you. It's like I can finally think straight. Well, we had a potential for better weapons, but guess not. All right, quick dump of our food type gear. Um, dirty water gourds, hub flowers, silk beans, all of those tatoes, the tar berries. Oh, that, that cuts back my weight a lot. Um, I don't have any extra apparel. I have a few extra guns. We don't need that. We don't need that. We don't need that. Sledgehammer's cool, but I like the super sledge kind of stuff. Alright. Deposit all the junk. And I think I'm actually good to go. Alright. So... That was kind of a bust. I was oh, we need to talk to Preston. Where the shit did he go? He's this way, 48 meters. <laughs> Preston! We haven't talked to you in like 12 hours. What's yeah. going on? You know that settlement you sent me to help? They've decided to join the Minutemen. That's great news. I knew you were the right person for the job. By the way, you should have one of these flare guns. You can use it to signal for help. From any nearby Minutemen. Um, Not much use yet, but once we have more allied settlements, you'll have help whenever you need it. Oh, so, interesting. There's something I need to ask you. 
I guess okay. you know I'm one of the last of the Minutemen. Mm-hmm. But I never really told you what happened to us. Tell me the lore. Are you really the last Minuteman? Maybe not literally. There must be a lot of former Minutemen out there who gave it up in disgust after the Quincy Massacre. But we were the last active group of Minutemen. And now, well, it's just me. And what's the Quincy Massacre? What was the Quincy Massacre? I thought everyone in the Commonwealth knew about that by I now. I was frozen. I was with Colonel Hollis's group. A mercenary group called the Gunners was attacking Quincy. The people there called for the Minutemen to help. We were the only ones that came. The other groups, they just turned their backs on us and the folks in Quincy. Only a few of us got out alive. Colonel Hollis was dead, so I ended up in charge of the survivors. We never found a safe place to settle. One disaster after another. You saw how it ended in Concord? Damn. What was the Quincy Massacre? I thought everyone in the Commonwealth oh, knew about I just that, asked that now. I was with Colonel Hollis's group. A okay. mercenary group keep called going, the keep Gunners going. was attacking Quincy. The people there called I thought you'd for give the me some more background info. We were the only ones that came. The other groups, they just turned their backs on us. Also, I'm starting to get the hang of the conversation. Some, the top options... Only a few of us got out alive. Like, certain options Colonel seem Hollis to let you dead. keep asking things, and so certain ones just end conversations. So. We never found a safe place to settle. One disaster yeah. after another. You saw how it ended? Yes, I did. I also got to listen to you talk about it twice. Know how it feels, don't give up. Um... I know how it feels to be the last survivor. Yeah, I guess you do. That's why I'm talking to you. I can't rebuild the Minutemen, but I think you oh, can. Oh good, I get in charge of rebuilding? Why can't you do it? Why can't you lead the Minutemen? That's not who I am. I can get my men through a firefight. I can defend a perimeter against all odds, but that's not going to be enough to bring the Minutemen back from the brink. We need someone who can bring the whole Commonwealth together in a common cause. And since you're wandering around I stealing from everybody... <laughs> I've already followed you through hell and high water, and I'd like to think I have more sense than most. What makes you think I can do this? You saved us in Concord. There wasn't anything in it for you. Also, it's kind of cool you how Piper chimed in there. problems to deal with. But you did it anyway. That kind of selflessness has been a mighty short supply around here for quite a while. Uh, sure. Okay. I'll do it. It's gonna be a lot of responsibility. But I know you'll make this place better. Good. Good. Welcome aboard. I feel like this is a whole new star for the Miniman. And the Commonwealth, too. Don't worry. I'll be right well, the good news is I have enough gear in those chests over here to equip, completely equip everyone in the wasteland. Wait, did you just call me General? Why are you calling me General? The leader of the Minutemen has always held the rank of General. Our last leader was General Becker. After he died back in 82, nobody could agree on who should take his place. The one good thing about being the last Minuteman is there's no one to argue with me when I say you're the new General. Sweet. Now it's your That's job promotion. to make it more than an empty title. Got a strange message from a robot. Said it was from some place called Grey Garden. I couldn't figure out exactly what it wanted, but well, may as well check it out. You never know. Anything else? All right. So it looks like he is gonna send me around to like settlements and stuff to help people out. How are you feeling? I'm glad to have the chance to return the favor. After all the help you gave me, just let me know if there's anything else you need. Sounds good. Ooh, I can actually have him follow me now. Uh, I kind of like having Piper around, but maybe we'll have him come join us when we do uh, some more settlement missions. So I'm sure anytime we help out a settlement, he's just going to greatly, greatly increase in happiness, and we can actually get to the uh, ability to you need a get minute. his perk. Um, I want to trade a few things. Whatever you need, General. No, you got more flares. Minuteman hat, Minuteman outfit. Colonial Duster. Yeah, he looks better like that. Why can't your base armor just be cosmetic? Anything else? 
Nope, that should be it. No. Not for the good work. Right. Also, I saw someone wandering around without a purpose. Someone who's consistently a little bit of a bitch to me. So guess what? She's going to be the first line of defense for the town. She's going to be the one that gets shot at. Things going well with the crops? Ooh, look at these. Yoink. Seems to be growing well. Yoink. Yoink. I'll try to your make job myself for you. useful. <laughs> no one wants to see a grown man feeling sorry for himself. Huh. Yep. Not doing your job for you I at all. I need to assign someone to this. Wait, really? I need to assign someone to this. If I just move it down over here next to all the rest of the crops. That's assigned. Well, now I've lost that. All right, let's put some more corn down. All right, so what do we got? We have 23 defense and 16 food and water, so we can definitely plant some more crops. A lot more corn. The more corn we have, the more of that adhesive stuff I can make later. Ugh, why won't you let me plant you close together? Boom. No, don't store it in the workshop. No. Okay, so let's see where this Grey Garden place is. There's Abernathy Farm. Oh yeah, we can go return and talk to them. Um, but that's a settlement, because I think all the little farm-looking things are settlements. So, I think what we should do is leave those for now until we have Preston with us. Grey Garden's down here. Uh, I kind of want to just go... Let's see what other random quests we have to do. Um, as soon as I find Marcy and tell her to get her ass up on one of those um, guard towers. I think she's got the shotgun, which is actually probably the dumbest thing I could have given her for that job. But... I'm sick and tired of her wandering around and me not being able to find her. Like, she's a named character. Hopefully she has some development where she's not just an ass. Also, no one seems to be working those scrap recovery things, which is kind of annoying. I see you guys just chilling out. Can I assign Mama Murphy some a job? Mama Murphy, you have supernatural sight abilities. Maybe you can find better scrap. No, don't store. Stop trying to store things. she go? She's in a bright yellow helmet. Like, this should not be hard to find her. She's not even guarding the area around the base, which is why I want to assign her onto the posts. Ooh. Maybe I can make him one of the... Oh, there she is. Maybe I can make him one of the merchants? Okay, that just buffed our defenses even more. Actually, I kind of like him wandering around. But, if he doesn't have a job, I can get make him the other shopkeeper. Alright, defense is 29. Wow, that is really high defense. I'm just going to actually make him the shopkeeper, because we don't need that much defense. Boom. All right, that should keep everybody happy. What quests can we go do? All right, Trouble Waters, travel to Grey Garden, pull the plug. That's not going to happen until that graphics glitch fixes. Find Nick Valentine, that's main story. Go to the Chem Lab, follow the Freedom Trail. Out in left field. Um, let's see where that one is. I'd like to do some Brotherhood of Steel stuff. And that's just a return, that's just a return. Alright, so it looks like it's all down here. Wait, Mass Pike Tunnel West, there's still something to do there? And then this is where all the baseball stuff is. What did we still need to do in Mass Pike Tunnel West? Um, I guess we could 
mark that as well. I don't like the miscellaneous quest system. Um, that was getting his daughter's locket back. We cleared that place. Like, there's nothing left to do in there. Maybe I just have to turn the quest in? Hmm. Weird. Alright, well, let's just fast travel to... Um, here, because there's a whole bunch of quests to turn in there. There's Talk to Bobby near Good Neighbor. Combat Zone, the Atomo Toys. Oh, this is where we were wandering around, like all those buildings and stuff that we came out at. Can I just fast travel? There we go. And actually, since we're going to get a whole bunch of EXP, why don't we find a quick bed and get some extra bonus experience from the Lover's Embrace perk? Thank you, game, for reminding me with helpful tips on your long, long load screens. Reconstruction Surgeon can give you a whole new face. Yeah, I like my face. You don't mind us staying at your place now, do you, Piper? <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Uh. Hmm. I love this woman. What's that she, she restocked her loot. And inside there's junk. It is not junk. It is all valuable. Nah. You can't stop the press. Not trying to, kid. Not trying to. Taking your teddy bear, though. For the greater good! <gasps> right away! Printing press. Oop, is there stuff on? Yeah. Oh, no, we already read the synthetic truth. Oh, we never did read our article! Alright, we should probably read the article she wrote about us after we finished stealing all of her stuff for the second time. Fashionable glasses! Do you look good in fashionable glasses? Heads up. Where to? This is gonna look hilarious. <laughs> no. I think we've done that before. Actually, since we're in town, there we go. Fancy dress. Fancy print. French coat. All right. So let us actually read her new article on us. Let's see if she says bad things. <laughs> He goes under miscellaneous. It was View from the Vault Part 1. Please don't be long. If you had to split into three parts. Whenever I take a walk through Diamond City, there are so many things people tell me to be grateful for. Purified water, working lights, electricity, security. True, what we have would have been unthinkable even a few decades ago, but it's easy to forget that even after all the progress we made. We are still living in the shadow of a world that was world before the threat of radiation, before the super mutant and the feral ghoul and the synth. Okay, so it's terrible newspaper writing, but it is great, great story writing. <laughs> so as fortunate it has it, I cross paths with Ghost, Vault Dweller, a person who has experienced the Commonwealth for the first time. What was his fresh eyes say about before we've come? Is Diamond City the great green jewel we've always claimed to be? Before we begin to answer that question, we have to know who Ghost is, where he comes from. My surprise, he did not have much to say about his life in the vault at all, because he spent all that time staring at a piece of frozen glass. Every day for over two centuries. He isn't just a vault dweller, he's an original vault dweller. Spent his entire life inside the cryogenically suspended. Continued in part two. Why would you make these multiple parts? Your other one droned on for 30-something pages. So what does he have to say? Can you compare the two? The world out there, it's not... Even close to the one that left. When we think of our city as a shining jewel, it's worth remembering that not everyone comes here by choice. Sometimes people are forced from the comfort of their homes and the largest settlement in the Commonwealth. This is where they end up. Most are just looking for refuge, but sometimes they come here desperately looking for something or someone. Ghost is looking for his son, Sean. Even though they were in the relative safety of vault, someone broke in and took Sean from his parent. And that parent is now risking everything, wandering through the strange and unfriendly world of ours in order to save him from his kidnappers. 
We all know the rumors and whispers that surround every missing person in Diamond City. The guilty looks we pass to mourning family members as we thank the wall that this time it wasn't us. You can end up dead in the Commonwealth for a million reasons. Why spend our time worrying about kidnappings? Why indeed? Interestingly, we gave this article, so I was not expecting much new stuff from it, but it, you know, kind of nice to see her tie it in with this current situation. Easy for us to be cynical about the missing. We have spent so long knowing the Institute is out there, but knowing so little about them. They are not the only ones responsible for kidnappings, but the fact that they sometimes are, and the fact that we have been so powerless to stop them when they do, causes us to treat all victims as if they were a lost cause. But the people left behind, those loved ones, friends, neighbors, who may never see the faces of those taken from them again, they do not have the luxury of being able to just look away. They have to carry that loss. Wow. Bravo! Carry that loss with them. Even if everyone tells them to move on and forget. I can't believe I'm proofreading our freaking paper. Ask us to make a statement to Diamond City to give us an outsider's perspective on what it means to lose a loved one, how he feels. Maybe in some way it's how we should all how we all should feel. Maybe we've forgotten that the right human response to these tragedies. No matter how much you want to give up, don't, he said. You have to have hope that you'll see them again, or at least that you'll know the truth. End. Well, I was hoping she'd tie in some more lore and stuff to that, but that's fine. Alright, well, it is late, so no one is going to be around the city to do really anything with. Hello? Someone has a secret uh, love of yum-yum deviled eggs. Oh, not sleep in an owned bed, but 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 I thought we had something, Piper. Ah, uh. well, that's just disappointing. Oh right, we have our own place in the city. Uh, I'm a dumbass. Yeah, it's late at night. Only the robot is here to talk to. Feed the trade! We're always open! Every conceivable good you could yes. ever need is right here! Let's talk more trade. If you don't have it, it's inconceivable! <laughs> I'll take a look, sure. Oh, goody! Oh, damn it, I didn't. I kept the flare gun. That's. Well, it's only two weight, it's not that big of a deal. You can have some fashionable glasses. You can have the red bandana. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. Oh, wow. Melons are actually worth a decent amount. Hmm. And they weigh a lot, so I'm just going to get rid of them. We have more than enough back at base. Ooh, we got 14 purified water. Holy crap. And get rid of the deviled eggs. Um. Oh shit, I still have all that junk I grabbed. Err. Damn it, I don't have a whole bunch of, like, random crap to sell him. But I usually do. Alright, do you have any good weapons? Someday you're gonna sell, like, a special weapon, because I can afford them now. Oh well. I'll take what I can get. All right, I guess we can go spend the night in my... Wow, hello. Oh, it's all locked off. Like, that's a huge section of town I've never seen before. Ah, uh, nothing like the place that I stole the key from, from the mayor's safe. I should probably take Piper up there sometime so she can read his computer. I think that would be hilarious. Okay, let's sleep for... Let's make it midday-ish. Oh, ten hours, whoa. Uh, yeah, seven hours. That should get us a decent perk. Then we can go turn in all these quests, get the bonus 15% experience, because we have the Lover's Embrace perk. Wakey, wakey, boo. Come on. Time to move. Yep. And away we go. Alright, not getting distracted by things, turning in quests first for the bonus EXP, then shopping. You watch your step. Got my eye on you. Mm -hmm. Self-prescribed chems, as recommended by me, myself, and I. 
Find that burn. <laughs> Should be easy to spot. I got one. Found the plant. Here you go. All right. Here's your payment, plus some samples from the pharmacy. Don't take them all at once now. Moderation. Now, I don't you are like the drag, nicest drug dealer. Business here. Let's see what you have. Chems for a balanced lifestyle. Ooh, and 125 bio caps. I will sell you your chems right back to you. There's your buff out. There's your jet. There's your psycho. And that will work for me. All right, that one's done. Then there is... Oh. Okay, look at this and tell me if you ever would have thought that was a door. I thought it was a totally just his wall. I'm glad he gave us a quest to go down here because I never would have figured it. Any kind of facial reconstruction surgery done in here? Yeah, I'm not trusting it. A new it. face. Strong, but not perfect. For a nominal fee, Doc Crocker can give you the looks you've only dreamed about before. Yay, we've completed it. Um, Wait, let's talk to what him, are you but do? not I'm spend 100 caps on surgery. It. Not just any surgery. Facial reconstruction surgery. Safe Adorable and kitty instantaneous. Over there. New jawline. New eye color. Remove can scars. I take painting? Add scars. A new you. A more perfect you. That is a really adorable painting. Maybe later. I'll keep the scalpels warm. Okay, warm scalpels. That didn't... Oh. I want all the blood packs, but I can't steal with Piper here. And we have quest complete. I also did not get any points for completing that quest, so... That sucks. Alright, there's... I think all the rest of them are out in the wasteland? Is there any more even here? Nope. Why does it keep telling us we need to go back there? What quest is that? Oh, we can bring the blowfly gland to Dr. Duff. That should get us some points. Alright, let's take that one off. That one we're going to do with Preston when we get him. And then there's that one. Oh. That was my own marker. I'm a dumbass. Alright, let's go over to the science center. Um, Science center. Home plate. Re unlock Need requires the key. key. Interesting. Yeah? Yeah. Oh no. Whatever it is, keep it to yourself. Fine, didn't want to talk to you anyway. Sure. You watch your step. You have my eye on you. Son oh my god, we can go into everybody's houses. Steal stuff. But first we must complete quests for science. Hi, remember us? We were the ones who... Dissecting a bloat fly can be fun. Just avoid getting stung to death, and you'll be a junior scientist in no time. Yep, we did that. You know, we had the big emotional, like, heart-to-heart -heart talk right in the middle of your room. You know. Can't break the code. Oh, I need a master. Oh. Oops. Hey, Dr. Duff. Have fun out there, and don't get killed. That'd be bad for progress. Come back once you have that bloat fly gland, and you'll earn that prize. I have one. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. I dumped it off. I dumped it off. Also, I have an extra perk. I did not realize I leveled up. Alright, level 15. Uh, no. What am I gonna do at level 15? Could get another level of armor. I could start working down the Life Giver tree. 
That gets me more maximum health, and I'll eventually get regeneration, which is fantastic. Um, crap, I had it all figured out what I wanted to get each level. Um, so I'm level 15 now. So I wanted to pick up armor or two, so I can make the better armor mods. All right. Nice. Because now I can put pockets on everything. Deep pockets, I believe, as well, so we can really up our carry weight for more looting fun. Hmm. I wonder if anyone sells a bloat flag land in town. I think that might actually be the easier way to uh, you need a get a hold of one. The John super <sighs> you want your meat sliced thin? You can cut it your damn self. Do you have bloat flag lands for sale? I'll take a look. Sure. As fresh as it can be. Ah, oh, you got bloat fly meat. You ain't gonna last once you leave the wall, so don't get you. I'll check out your weapon stock. And they in a sell second. just about everything, but none of it is scrap. You sell bloat like land. Let's see what you have. A bit of everything. <gasps> Ooh. Only 800 caps. Does reduce my damage resistance, but I'm better energy, and it gets me agility and perception. Do you have any good guns? Ooh, flamer. Nice. Probably not going to buy one because I hate using the flamethrowers, but... Come on, bloat flag land. Ah. Alright. Well, it's easy enough to do this quest. I think there was a... There's a lake right here. I'm betting you if we head to the lake, we're going to find some bloat flies. Because they always tend to hang around like water Look, and just whatnot. Leave me alone. Or there might be some around the uh, town's lake. We never did talk to the kid. Because he was always busy when we were trying to go over there and talk to him. I could steal all your crops, but I will resist for now. Time City Radio. We already talked to Travis, and I don't want to open the radio because it might be playing. Aww. Wanted the loots. Oven mitt. Fresh water market. Open for business. Hey, hey there. kid. Pure fed water. You won't find this out on the Commonwealth. Oh, sweet. I actually do need uh, to buy you purified buy yourself water for That's right. adhesives. Put on my own since I was eight. I'm a fully independent man. Got my own place. Go to night classes. The whole shebang. Now, I how like about you, I give kid. you a bottle of water, huh? Anything I can do to help out? Ah, the industrious type. Want to help me clean out the water supply? You won't believe the junk people throw in there. Overloads the filters. Um. All right, she likes it when I pass speech checks, and I actually get bonus experience for this. So I'm going to be a little bit greedier because she already likes me. Depends. What's this worth to you? Ah, uh, no. We're not doing this. Oh. for the job. No oh, and she just liked it too. What kind of Fine. stuff is there? You're looking for big things. Anything around the size of a book, usually. Ah, <sighs> fine. I'm on it. Just don't drown. I'll never clean your carcass out of there. So explain to me why your perk gives me bonuses when I persuade people, but you dislike me when I persuade people. Uh, something tells me, ten to one, that I'm not going to like being in this water. Almost well, certainly irradiated. Let's see, can I get... Um, do I have anything radiation resistance? No, but I do have the mutant hound shops which will remove radiation from me, so I can actually use those. Uh. You know what? 
I will be right back because... Alright, let me dip a foot in the water to see if it's radiated. You wanna get out of here? Oh god, that is... I don't know, I think I would look make an awesome pool. You... Well, maybe. We'll see. Alright, where is the drug don't vendor? Let the stress of life kill you. Relax with some cams. Do you have any radiation resistance stuff? Thanks again for the fern. Plants like that are hard to come by. More than happy to help. Uh, you here to pick up some cams? Hey, Solomon. Gotta pick me up if you're feeling glum. I've got a few minutes to browse. Self-served medicine. Come on, Radex. Red resist a hundred. Nice. I will take one. 83 caps. Stuff the kid pays me barely covers it because he decided not to stiff, or he decided to stiff me. Apparently he has a higher charisma than I do, but whatever. Actually, I probably should apply it. I don't know how long it lasts. Let me apply it at the water's edge. Swatters, right here. Is that a pit bull? My left arm for one of those. What, you lost? For sale. Hand tooled pieces. Enjoyed, All right. So we gotta find. Ooh, hello, what's this building? Abbott's house. Interesting. I'm gonna have to come back here one time when I have a locked or a thieving friendly companion and just find out everyone's backstories. See all their dirty laundry and whatnot. Purified water. All right. Here we go. Rad X. Don't die of thirst out there in the Commonwealth. Ah, oh, that's better. It's not ten X. It's two. Um, toaster. A skull. Um, typewriter. Piper, did you get angry at a newspaper article? A bucket. <laughs> what else is in this water here? I thought I saw something dip down in there, but whatever. Turning my light on? No, light does not help at all. Um... Fresh water. Come on, people. Damn it, the first four were easy to find. Mouth. There we are. <laughs> Ah, well, I guess that was worth it because that much radiation would have been five times worth it. That would have been half my health bar, and I would have wasted two radexes or radaways again. So, I guess I need to start keeping some radex on me. It is handy at times. Look how clean the water is now. Good job. Here's your pay. Now, how about you pick up some bottles for the road? Oh yeah, you want to explain why there's a human skull in there? Shing? Why was there a skull in the water? So maybe you weren't the first person I asked. Oh, God. Maybe the last guy found an unstable hand grenade. Hey, Whoa. once the filters do their job, it's all water under the bridge. Am I right? Anyway, uh, need some water? <laughs> she charged sure. for water. Let's take a look. The filters clean out everything. 41 bucks? It's still not bad. I think I'll pass for now, Shang. All right, so we had a little mini quest in town. Um, we've already talked to Abbott. Oh, their food hasn't grown back yet. No, you must grow your foods faster so I can steal them again. Over here? No. Damn. Hmm. Well... Why don't we go get that bloat fly thing? It's just right outside. New we'll probably get distracted. View from the vault, an outsider's perspective on the Commonwealth. Can I get... There you are. Public is here to pull the wool out from under your eyes. It's the, the wool from over your eyes. Under your eyes would be very painful, kid. You know, I'm kind of curious about that rich guy over here. He seems like there'd be something suspicious going on with him. Let's just go check him out real quick before we leave. Probably nothing. Some guy came into town, said he picked up a weird distress call in the Cambridge ruins. Yeah, we already helped the Paladin guy. Hawthorne residents have to unlock that, and Piper doesn't like it when I pick people's own property. Oh, hello, random ass people. Who are you? Ah, another low life coming to drink with us, I see. Oh, shut up, Wellingham. Excuse me. Well, hello there. 
Another one of the poor and stupid of Diamond City come begging for table scraps? Wow, you guys are bitches. The poor and stupid? Oh, don't act like you don't know. There's two types of people in this town. The ones living in the stands and everyone beneath us. I know everyone Whoa. in the stands and that doesn't include you. Now why don't you make yourself scarce? Bitch. And miss basking in your delightful personality? Do what you like, but I'm done talking to you. <laughs> Piper liked it. Good, I could be an asshole. Why, people. hello there. So lovely to see more young people up here in the stands. You <laughs> also... We need to You talk. just walked oh. right up into the stands, didn't you? I like your stones. Hi. You should have a drink. What good is it having a cocksure youth among us if we don't stiffen him up with some liquor? Okay, let's talk to the nice Eustace. old lady. You should meet my grandson. Oh, not that he would ever come up here. No, Hawthorn has too much of his mother in him. Wait, Hawthorn? Was that the guy we... Hold on. Uh, just excuse me for a second, dude. Um, was that the one guy we uh, killed? I am, I might have some uh, unfortunate information for you. Let's see. Um... Was that a miscellaneous one? No, we helped out the guy with his wife. Where did that go? Um, that's interesting. Oh no, that it was this one, Diamond City Blues. Ambush, Nelson, Latimer's chem deal. Okay, it was Nelson. Whew. Thought we killed her son, grandson. Okay, fine. Is there a problem? The problem is that I've learned that you killed my son, Nelson. Oh, it was your son. Interesting. What makes you think I killed him? Morosky says so. One of his guys saw you do it. Hey, I killed all those guys. Cold blood. I dare you to deny it to my face. Did you do it? Hmm. You'd be sarcastic again. I mean, we did kind of kill this dude's son. Um. <laughs> I guess this is our just desserts for killing that guy. I mean, we helped patch up one relationship. Admittedly, she only cared about him for his money, so I still don't know if we're good or bad guys on this one. We could just try to bluff our way out of this. Wouldn't that be great if our charisma worked? I didn't kill Nelson. Whoever told you that was lying. Uh, you are an easy target for anyone. To <laughs> charisma wins themselves. again. If it wasn't you, then who was it? Do you know who killed Nelson? Um, let's find out who we. I want to know me. who told you it was me. I heard it from Morosky, low-life Kim pusher from Good Neighbor. Maybe he okay, has we don't some know him yet. to bring trouble down on you. So, do you know anything about who killed Nelson? Oh yeah. Wait, Paul Pembroke. Shit, was Paul the? Was Paul the guy we helped? I don't want to blame him. I can just say no idea. I have no idea. Well, all right. I'll take your word for it. For now. But if I hear that you were the one lying to me... My grandson calls himself Hawthorne, but it's really his last name. I'm oh, used to Hawthorne, Shoot. and his father was Julius Mrs. Hawthorne. You're bothering me again? Yes, I want to be sarcastic uh, to you some more. What? If you insist on embarrassing yourself Shut with up. alcohol, I'm uh, programmed <clears throat> to oblige. Again. What? Prefer the company of old men? We have the benefit of years of experience, you know. <laughs> uh, Are you hitting on me? me? I'll take a look, sure. Tastes for a sophisticated palate. Probably expensive as shit. Wow. You're selling dirty water to these people, really? Hawthorne's mother was the adventurous type, too. She gave him such a lovely first name. It's a shame he doesn't go by it. Alright, so these are these assholes' place. 
Oh ho! We've got the key! Wow, fancy digs. Please don't be stealing, please don't be stealing, please don't be stealing. Ah, it's stealing. Can't do it with her around. Uh, let's see, is there any notes or anything that I can... He has got his own boat. The shit. Yeah, throw your beer in the water. What do you think of that? There's no incriminating notes, nothing we can use to torment these horrendously stuck-up people. Nothing. I mean, he's got enough freaking chems to last a lifetime. I mean, it's all, like, stim packs and stuff. Hmm. Well, at least we got Scott got away with uh, murder, essentially. <laughs> Thank you, my charisma. I can't believe we passed that check. That was a red one, too. And we couldn't pass up. We couldn't convince the stupid kid to pay us more money to drown ourselves in his radiated lake. Cook residents can't. Okay. Colonial Tap House. And the Codman residence. Now well, let's go see what's in the. Did we already check the Tap House? Yeah, this was... I wonder who's running it now that the other guy left town. No one, apparently. But we still can't steal anything. <gasps> when it ale brewing subroutines. Interesting. <gasps> and a safe. Okay. Some people need some comeuppance. Piper, come with me. This guy has gotten in us into more shit. So, Piper, you are you going to do Scabba. me a favor. And your sister a favor, Piper. Oops, sorry, officer. Hey. Piper, what you got for me? You need to go spend some uh Go yeah, check go that ahead. out. Sorry, not possible. Okay, I can't have you check out your own sister, which is kind of creepy now. Head over there. Go. Of course. Go hang out with your sister. And you know. Wait there. Okay, I'll be here then. You know, you need to spend some good quality time with your little sis. I'm going up well, here to well, totally not Diamond steal everything into. Number one troublemaker. Oh, I got my eye on you. No, you better, because I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna steal everything. All right, Nat didn't follow me. This place is mine. First off, oink. All types of canes in coated sour routines for the brewing of Gwinnett brand Dead Coat Ale. Sweet. All right, let's pick this lock. That's it. Aha! That's my 50th lock picking. Yoink. Yoink, yoink, yoink. Yoink, 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 yoink. Save in case anyone comes in while I'm doing this. Still no one? Good. Not like the guy who owned the bar is going to need any of this stuff anyway. Yoink. Oh! Oh! It was just the animation of walking into the chair. Oh god, that scared the hell out of me. I thought someone walked in on me. Prefer to do my stealing in secret, thank you very much. Ha, ha, ha. Eh. Smash. You know what? Oh, I can't flip chairs and stuff. Oh. 
Ooh, hello. I missed something. Yeah. I'm on top of the bar. Nobody can stop me. Ah, ah, ah. And now... Whose was the resident up here that I actually had access to? Because I can't steal anything from here because that guard is watching. Although I can probably get into these guys. So we've got Cook. We've got Latimer. And we've got... Hawthorne. I'll so be let's breaking see. Out the cheap Codman. So that's, there, she's uh, Hawthorne, Codman, Latimer. Alright, I have no problem stealing from Latimer. The other guys, I mean, kinda, sorta, mean. The old lady was nice, Hawthorne was nice, I won't steal from her. Let's hope he likes drinking late into the day. Killed your son, I'm robbing your house. What you gonna do about it? Mine! Everything is mine. So you get for being a dick. What you get? Even though I kind of just cleaned up his apartment because I just got all his... Is there anything underwater here? Anything secret? It's a lot of rads, but... I just got a rat away from him anyway. Nothing under here. Damn. I was hoping he'd have, like, a secret safe or something underwater. Uh-oh. Ah, do I get out of it? Alright, well, we stole the rat away from him, so let's use the one we stole. Ah. Did we get everything? There wasn't a hidden safe or... Secret, secret. Hello, sir. I'm just going to... Oh, fuck. I got caught. Run. Okay, that pissed off the whole town. I don't like saves coming, but that pissed off the entire town. Alright, we gotta do this quick. Before he gets back. He's a fast drinker. High value targets first. Taking your fishing rod, bitch. And your telephone. I'm out! <laughs> oh, that was... Ah, I kind of <laughs> deserve some of that. I was like, I was wondering if he was going to drink long enough for me to steal everything or not. I well, know we didn't have to waste that rat away. He's none the wiser.